In this video, we will learn why background information is an important component of your research and how to use library resources to find background information and reference sources. Background information provides key facts on a topic or event, summarizes the important issues, can suggest further reading, and is great for generating topic ideas. This video will cover finding background information using encyclopedias, handbooks, and news sources. You can also find background information on SFU Libraries research guides, as you may have seen in another video. Finding background information is an important step in your research process, and knowing where to locate the best sources can make your research process more efficient. Let's get started by taking a look at some of the sources of background information available on the SFU Library website. The SFU Library has a collection of online reference sources, which are a great place to find background information on a topic. From the SFU Library homepage, hover over the Find menu and click on Background Sources. This page lists the online reference sources available through the SFU Library. Certain online reference sources let you search many encyclopedias at once. We call these multi-purpose reference sources, and they are a great place to start your research. Scroll down the main reference sources page to see the multi-purpose reference sources. Today, we're going to use Gale Virtual Reference Library. Click on the Gale Virtual Reference Library link to see more information about it. Click on Connect to access the Gale Virtual Reference Library. If you are off campus, this is when you will be prompted to enter your SFU computing ID. Let's search for climate change in the Gale Virtual Reference Library. This article looks promising. Let's click on it to read more. Encyclopedia articles cover the basic facts on a subject. For example, key concepts, background information, and significant people and dates. One of the best things about reading an encyclopedia article is the bibliography or further reading section. This provides you with ideas for other reputable sources you can read for more information. Let's navigate back to the SFU Library homepage. To find more background information about your topic, you can use encyclopedia or handbook as a search term in the fast search box. Take a look at the search results. If you only want to see what online handbooks the library has, use the left-hand menu to filter your search results. Click on Items with Full Text Online and Book or eBook. Let's click on the first book. Handbooks provide a substantial overview of a topic. They're designed to be easily consulted. Just like with an encyclopedia, you can check the bibliography for each chapter for even more information about your topic. Let's navigate back to the SFU Library homepage. We'll now move on to news sources. You can find background information on a topic by searching for stories in the popular media using news sources. To find news sources, click on the Article Databases link on the left-hand side of the library homepage. Under the Browse Databases by Subject Area menu, scroll all the way down to News Sources and click on it. The News Sources page lists all the main news databases available through the SFU Library. Use a database like Canadian Newsstand to search for timely information in the local, regional, and national media. Type in your search terms and click Search. When you search in a news source, you often get a lot of results. Check out our video tutorial on advanced search techniques for tips and tricks to refine and improve your searching skills. Mm -hmm.